bitches, it's me, Eric, your daily dose of a hot mess, and today I am doing an unboxing video, and this is actually my very first unboxing video because I don't purchase luxury goods all that often, I'm cheap as fuck, and I'm pretty sure you guys don't want to see me unbox like $10 slippers from Walmart. To be honest, I wasn't even in the market for a Burberry watch, I was just like walking by the counter, and as soon as I saw it, I just had to have it. It is stunning, it is beautiful, and I cannot wait for you guys to see it, so let's get started. Started. Alrighty, so let's get unboxing. The watch comes inside this cardboard box and I'm just gonna lift off the lid right here. And inside the cardboard box, you have the actual Burberry box, and I really like how it looks like. It's like a shiny gold against their signature tan color. Right now, I'm just going to take off the cardboard box and show you guys what's inside. Um, as you'll see in this unboxing, there's going to be many, many layers to this. The first layer is this watch box, and underneath the watch box, you have a little ribbon thing right here, and it's basically a contraption because when you pull upwards, the instruction manual slides out. There is a wax piece of paper that protects it from damaging its um, gold corporate logo again. And as you see, they're all the exact same thing, but just different sizes, large, medium, and small. I think it's like kind of cool for like their branding to be like this because it's very consistent. Inside this um, warranty book, there's just like your basic standard information about how to use a watch. I think everybody knows how to use a watch. Um, it tells you about the design of the watch, the functions of the watch. The most important thing and like the only thing I read in here is the warranty period because I think that's what anybody cares about. For Burberry watches, the warranty period is two years and that's international so it doesn't matter where you live. You have two years of warranty and what that warranty covers is any manufacturing details defects. It does not cover wear and tear or water damage like most standard watches. Uh, moving along now to the actual watch box. I'm going to open it up for you guys to show you all its glory. Are you ready for this bitches? Ta-da! Here it is! On here it has the word Burberry in gold. I like how it's in gold because it's very um, cohesive with all the other things about this product. The material inside the actual watch box is 100% suede. So everything here I'm touching right now is extremely, extremely smooth. And the watch is sitting on this um, watch holder thingy. I'm not sure what you actually call this, uh, but this is 100% suede as well. It's very, very luxurious. So here's the actual watch and as you can see it has a silver band and the face is a creamy pearl tone. My favorite part about this watch is probably the band because I like how chunky it is and it's very geometric. It creates like a nice reflection on your wrist but it's like not too chunky where it's like super thick and super like obnoxious like a diesel watch per se. Um, on the front of the watch it says Burberry and then it also has today's date and I'm not sure if can tell right now because of the glare from the lighting but on the like back of the watch there's like a very fade um, detailing of stripes like lines going back and forth and I think that's so cool because Burberry is like known for their like lines part of like their marketing um, I'll insert a picture right here if you have no clue what I'm talking about but I think it's cool how they translated this picture into like the background of the watch for people who are actually interested in the specs of the watch I'll just read to you what's in the back right here. Um, it says Burberry and then on the top it says BU 9000 50M 165 feet. On the bottom it says Swiss made sapphire crystal along with a code number so you know that it's an authentic Burberry watch. And on the front bottom it says Swiss made again. And if you know anything about watches or the watch industry you know that Swiss watches are worth the most because they're the most prestigious, they're the most durable and they also retain the most value in the long run. And what I mean by that is say in 10 years, you were to go pawn this watch at a pawn shop, you'll probably get 50 to 70% of the selling price or the price you originally paid for. Unlike watches that are made in China where you'll probably get nothing at all. I purchased this for 500 Canadian dollars and a Swiss watch for $500 is such a steal in my opinion. 
because Swiss watches go up to like $20,000, Rolexes, Omegas can easily exceed that amount. On the back of the watch, there is the clasp right here, and it is a butterfly clasp. And if you're not familiar with how a butterfly clasp works, it goes like this. You snap on this part first, and then you also snap on this part, and then when you have both parts snapped on, you'll see a Burberry text right here engraved into the watch. Alrighty, so that's going to be all for this video. If you did like it, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more Merrick. If you want to see more unboxing videos and review videos, you can do that by clicking right here on the screen. And until next time, that was your daily dose of a hot mess. Bye, bitches! I mean I could, but why would I want to?